Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Micah and welcome back to Creating Creations. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a simple aquaponic garden. So without further ado, let's jump right into this project. Okay, so as you can see, I'm starting out this video showing you all of the supplies that I used. And as you can see, it's mostly a whole bunch of elbows, a few tees, and the main part of the pipe I'm using here is 2 inch width PVC pipe. That's what I'm going to be growing the plants in. Um, the one inch pipe that you see is just the pipes carrying the water to the two inch pipe from the pump. So I'm not giving any specific dimensions of how much, how long the pipe is, just simply because no one's going to make this project exactly like mine. I made mine to fit the shape of where I am doing it at. I'm just going to show you how to do it, so yeah, that's so I'm just telling you to with. Okay, as you can see, we need a pond. You need a pond of some sort that you can raise your fish in. And as you can see, I stacked the center box to in like a triangle form to come downwards. I just set my pump down right there. And now I'm attaching all the PVC pipe, one inch PVC pipe onto the pump just to pump the water out. Do this ever how it works with your, um, your fish tank. Okay, and so right now I'm just attaching the PVC pipe to attach to the two inch PVC pipe, which I will be growing in and I'm attaching to the left and to the right of where it comes in because the way this system is going to work is water will flow in two directions when it comes in, part through the left and part through the right. It all makes sense later on. Okay, just laying out the PVC pipe here. Laying out some more. Got a ton of elbows, as I already mentioned. And you can probably see the way the water is going to flow. Part of it will flow to the left, part of it flows to the right. And then once the water cycle is out, they both connect and flow into the, um, the fish tank. Oh, um, and as the water falls into the fish tank, it will also not only replenish the water back into it, because it's actually just the same water just cycling it, um, but it will oxygenate the water so the fish can breathe. And yes, the fish do need oxygen. <laughs> I am just, I am actually did not use any glue with this project. I'm just simply um, hammering the PVC pipe together. This is not a hammer, it's like a rubber mallet. If you use a regular hammer, it will crack your PVC pipe. But I'm just using that to fit your feet together tightly. And right now I am attaching some wire to hold up the drain pipe because it's not resting on any center box. Again, just however you design yours, do it that way. That works. It's just to show you how to do it. Okay, right now I am using a drill to drill out holes in the top of the PVC pipe, and these this will be where I put where I grew my plants from. Um, I did mine, if I remember right, eight, I did mine, I think about a foot apart, or it's like 14 inches apart. Again, I do not know. Okay, well that's it for part one of the aquaponic garden build video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, in part two of this video, I will be showing you um, some improvements that I made to this and just all about me learning how to raise fish and grow vegetables from the fish. Um, anyhow, hope you enjoyed that video. I can't wait to catch you guys on the next video. If this is your first time seeing my channel, feel free to subscribe to my channel, ring the little notifi notification bell, and like this video if you did enjoy it. And if you know anyone that you think would also enjoy it, please, please, please share it with them. Uh, that really helps me out. Anyhow, I'll catch you guys on the next video, and have a great time till then. Bye.